I think that was Puzzle Rush. I think that was just Checkmate. Let's play Lord Lord Lillian at 3-0. Um, play uh, E5. Let's play Knight C3. Bishop C4. This is um, this is uh, this is um. I think this is rapport, if I'm not mistaken. I mean, Daniel's rating is ridiculous. Why is Daniel 29? Why is Daniel like 2950 at Blitz and like? 3,000, like, 60 at, at bullet. Like, he should be 3,100 plus. This is ridiculous. Uh, let's play... I guess I'll play bishop g5 and h4. g5, just bishop g3. I'll probably play knight e2. Um, but yeah, like, I mean, Dania, like, what is wrong with Dania? His ratings are a joke right now. I mean, Dania should not be... 2950 like Daniel should be 3000 plus on his worst day at blitz so i don't know what what's going on with daniel right now but he somehow has these ridiculous ridiculously low ratings no I'm, I'm spanking him like i beat him yesterday and i lost 10 points i beat him pretty soundly today and like i mean it doesn't make a difference because he's so low to start with like that's what i don't get is how he's so low okay i should obviously trade d4 and e5 Let's do it. I don't know if it's good, but I just can't resist trying to blast the center here. So he'll probably take... Or no, he goes f6. Okay. I can take maybe. I can also play d5. I think I'll play d5 here. And take maybe just knight c3 looks good. He'll probably trade. Although then I go f3, bishop f2. Um, let's play knight c3. Maybe knight b5 is an idea. Maybe I'll play queen a1. I'm gonna play knight b5, put pressure on the pawn, maybe c4, maybe f3. I've always got queen a1 ideas as well. I think I'll play c4, expand, expand the queen side. I don't know if queen a1, a7 is an idea. I'm not so worried about any attacks. This king is is very open, so I maneuver my bishop back where it belongs. Let's put the queen on d2. Rook h1. Ah, he's got ah, he's got this move. Shoot. That was bad. Okay, I still I'm still fine here, no issues, but but I mean can't really win now. That's the problem. Um, okay, let's go rook c1. Maybe b4 c5 is an idea. Okay, queen a5. I think I'll play queen e1. Try to go rook a1. If queen b4, okay, let's play rook a1. Uh his rook is his queen kind of getting a little trappy to here. Like rook a3, knight a2, his queen is getting a little bit eh, a little bit eh. This queen is a little bit, little bit, um, not where it wants to be at the moment. Um, I mean, knight a2 is a move. Okay, b5 is the only way to try and prevent it. I still feel like there's got to be something like rook, not, oh, whoops, what did I do? Whoops. Um, okay, cb5 doesn't quite work. Maybe rook a7, no. Um, I guess I'll just play c5, takes knight a2. Yeah, knight a2 and bishop c5. Or or I've got d6 here. Rook a7 looks strong too. Um, now I'm threatening rook b7. Knight a2, is queen, he's got all these ugly pawns. His king's on a bad square. His bishop's bad. Everything is just ugly, ugly, ugly here for black. Um, queen b3, I can just trade and maybe play d6. Um, Now I can take, I also have d6, which looks very obvious. Um, um, is d6 best? Can I take d6, queen b3, queen d2? Well, let's go with d6. I don't know what's going on. So I think I'm going to play queen d2, b4, dc7, bishop c6, rook b8, or queen c1. Um, I'm going to play queen c1 here. So on b4, I have knight d5. I also can just take the pawn because of the uh, pin on the queen. Very, very messy position. Knight f8. Okay, I'm going to play knight d5 here. Now I'm also... Oh, I could have sacked, maybe. Maybe. Knight b6 or... Wait, if I just take? What's he have? I'm threatening rook b8. I'm also threatening knight b6. Bishop c6, rook b8 is winning. If bishop d7, I trade and go knight b6, I think, and I just win. 
everything is nicely protected i make a queen next move takes and now i've got knight d6 knight um knight of five as well if knight d4 just queen d2 very chillax move just very chillax just chill out and just finish the game in style although he does uh oh shoot what is this c3 no okay takes knight of five no, but I can take and play queen d3. I also have knight of five. Uh, let's just play knight of five. It takes queen d7 wins because it's check. He moves the king, just queen d3 is winning, I think. Oh, but I'm way down. I'm down on time too. Okay. Oh, shoot. I blundered. Oh, my gosh. Oh, shoot. Um. Oh, that's just brilliant. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Unbelievable. Ugh, what am I doing? <sighs> garbage. Total garbage. Take and play knight f6. Um, let's take with the e pawn. Get a little too chillax. Exactly. Let's make a check play. It's a good old end game because end games are fun to play, as Magnus has shown us. Um, let's just trade uh, bishop d6. I'm going to play bishop f5, hit the pawn so he doesn't get the traditional c3 d4 setup. Um, I don't know about knight d4 because now I can hit the knight, which guards c2. Um, so I'm not knight d4. Okay, he's just gonna play d3. All right, that that makes sense. So knight d7. I mean bishop g4. I think just knight e5 is fine. Uh, now I'll go bishop e5. Oh, but he got rook b1. No, no es tan bueno. Okay, let's castle. Okay, I don't know if he's taking or not. I'm gonna play rook e8. King d8, takes, takes. Um, okay, so um, I guess I take, I think I want to keep the clump here like this. Okay, he's going to he's gonna play this again. I mean, I can trade and make a draw. I don't want to make a draw. I want to play for the, for the win. So first up first, let's put the pawns on different squares. So let's put them on light squares so that the bishop can't attack. I can always play a6. Um, do I want to play? I think I'll just play a6. Put everything on the light squares. Uh, f6, g5. Let's just start expanding. Maybe I'm not going to actually get that because now he, um, he take and play rook h4. That's a drop. I really uh, takes g4. Um, rook e1. Takes six. Check check king e6. C3. King. Um. G, oh, I mean, G, I want to take and play g4 and play this long end game, but can I actually calculate it? Takes king e6, a d4, king d5, c3. I mean, I just, I can't calculate it, so. Takes here, 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 here. Whatever, let's just, let's just go for it. I don't know if this works, but I figure his pawns are super loose. Okay, king c8. I'm going to play rook h4, rook a2 takes, takes, and I'm going to trust that. I'm basically going to trust these pawns are quicker than these pawns on the king side. Okay, he doesn't want it. Interesting. Okay, but now this is definitely not correct because now, now I'm definitely better. He's got double c pawns, passive rook. I've got the active rook. I'll pre move fg. Um, okay, interesting. I can play g. No, not g3. Okay, I'll just take and play maybe rook a5, put pressure on the pawn, d4, and just rook b3. Now rook c3 is a threat um it's so like h4 rook c3 i think is winning a pawn so he probably has to play like rook c2 and then g5 maybe okay rook c3 now he's gonna lose pawns here okay so he wants to ah okay i see his idea okay so if i take king d3 rook a4 rook g2 check king c4 takes takes and it's a draw or is it it's probably a draw but 
I'm not so sure. Check rook f3. Okay, rook. Um, okay, obviously rook h3. I can always hide the king behind the pawns here. So he doesn't have an insta draw. I've got f4, f3. Um, let's go king d8. Okay, king a7, obviously. Okay, so I will take a5. I'm going to play rook h2 next move. Okay, rook h3, rook a3, rook a4. Um, he a4 was a very serious mistake by uh, Richard. It still might be a draw, but he's gonna lose a4 now. And now all okay, I take. I've got to check on b4, king c3. Do I take or do I play king c6? That's another interesting question. I think I, I think I have. Um, let's see. Okay, rook h4, d6, rook h8. That looks like a bit too much, so I will take. Play rook b4. Oh, wait. Oh, shoot. Wait, what? Wait, what? I've got king b5, rook c4 check. Ah, he blundered. Oh, Richard was trying to get too clever. Now I have rook c4 check and I win the pawn. <laughs> oh, man. That's just game over, actually, because everything's protected now. Okay, let's go again. Let's play knight f3, keep it real. Let's keep it real. Play d4. What do I want? Okay, I'll just play b3, bishop b2. Um, play g3, please. I'll play g3 on move one, sure. I'll play g3 next white game. Uh, bishop d3 and queen d3. It takes, obviously. Oh, but, eh. I need to be careful. Yeah, because now he's going to go for some kind of mate ideas. Um, mm. Mm. Bishop h2 is a threat, so I'll play g3. Yeah, the... I think I'll play bishop a3. Try to exchange the bishop g4, just knight d2. Or knight e5, maybe. Or knight e1, I don't know. Um, all moves are playable. So if I take gf3, bishop f8, bishop f4, and queen f3 should be winning. Queen f6, bishop f4, gf3, bishop f8, bishop f4, and queen f3 should be winning. g5, queen f3, gf, ef, yeah, it's winning. Okay, good. Okay, takes so 95, obviously. It's gonna have to play a five or wait, isn't that just a free pawn? That's just a free pawn, I think. Although he's gonna he's gonna get counterplay on the H file, obviously. Although this I don't understand at all. Okay, so he's trying to play for F5 and quick attack. So I guess I will just retreat with Queen E2. And play for f3 next move or knight d2. If I get knight d2, I can exchange knights, then I should be fine. Okay, maybe just f3 takes and queen g2. Okay, now I'm close to okay. Um probably just knight c3. Takes eh. Takes an each. A little bit iffy. I'm gonna play f4. He's gonna castle or something, or go king f7. I need to maneuver, well, not maneuver. I need to um, just play good moves. I'll play rook f2 and rook d1. I think I'm gonna play rook c1 and rook g2. I'm trusting that he has no way to actually mate me here. Play knight d1, knight f2 maybe. I don't wanna do it. Let's just play um, b4. If queen h7, I think I'll, okay, takes, I take. Queen h7 or okay, plays knight d5, also logical. Maybe knight d1? No, let's play knight d1 and rook c2 to guard guard like this. Um, maybe knight f2, knight d3. If I can get the knight to e5, I win the game. But we'll see if I can get that. Uh, it's going to be hard to get that. Okay, I think I'll just play queen b3 and rook, eight, rook, H2, rook c2 next move. And just... Okay, but now I can play... No, no, now he's gone wrong because now he's giving me knight d3. 
Okay, that I was not expecting either. Um, maybe just... Uh, I've got to be careful, though. If I take... Okay, let's take and play knight c4. I've got knight e5. I've got rook b1 as well. Um, I think I'm good here. Knight, knight guards e3. Um, I'll just play a3. If b5, I think knight e5 and rook e2 should just be winning. Unless I'm missing something very obvious. Because he can't guard c6. My knight on e5 is a golden goose. Um, so I think everything's bad here for black. The sun. Here comes the sun, and I say knight c7, knight c5 to win e6, knight d3, c5 also. The whole house is collapsing for Mr. Rapport, I think. Um, rook a6, rook c8, though, so I gotta be a little careful. So I'll put the rook on c5, hit the pawn, threaten to take, knight g6, knight c6. Um, although, eh, okay, let's play rook c2. It's going to go back, so I'll go rook c6. Now the pawn on a6 is hanging. Okay, now I feel like I've got to be winning here somehow. Well, it's very tricky, though. Uh, oh, I'm getting low on time also, so I need to start um, just moving. Okay, let's play rook c1. Knight c6 is an idea. Um, let's play rook e1, put pressure on e6. Um, knight d3, knight c5, I guess. Okay, just takes, knight c5 back. Maybe rook e5 and knight c5 and win the pawn. The sun. Here comes the sun and I say it's all right. King e1, I've got rook f5, also d5 looks pretty strong. d5, d6, d7. Here comes the sun and I say D7, game over. Let's play a Karl Khan again. Um, oh, let's play something bunky. I don't feel like playing an exchange pan off at this particular moment in time, so let's keep it um, random. I guess queen a5 and just castle. Put pressure on the pawn. Um, what do I want to do here? Bishop f5, maybe? Why not? Just queen c7, knight d7. Oh, he's got that, that move. I guess I'll play knight e4, try to trade the knights. Oh, where's our Dutch? Oh, that's right. I'm supposed to play a Dutch for y'all, aren't, aren't I? Um, good point. I forgot about that. Okay, if I play knight d7, what, he's got g4 and d5 or something? Okay. Hmm. Just gotta move. Okay, I'll play b6. Um, I really want to play knight d7. How do I make it work? I can't. Okay, fine. I'll just play h5. Uh, h5 is a terrible move. Why do I play h5? No, that's just terrible for me. What am I doing? At least I'm gonna get some kind of development. I'm gonna finish my development, at least. That's the only bright, bright side to all this. Takes, I go e6 and queen f7 to counteract bishop h6. Now c5 kind of makes me a little happy, at least, because now I can play knight d7, knight f8. And even though the bishop is passive on b7, I can always play like e6 and plop a knight on d5. Thank you, live from the a50 for the resub. Um, okay, I've got to be careful. So I play e6, what's he have? Takes, takes, e6, I don't see it. Got knight f8, I also have b5 at the right moment. I don't like the way Richard is handling the position here. It still should be very good for white, but it feels like he's starting to misplay this. Um, I can play b5 or knight f8. I think I'll just play, play b5, kick the bishop, and play rook e8. This rook e8, support e6, out of the pin as well. I've got knight h7, knight f8. The position has gotten a lot better for me, suddenly, for no particularly good reason. Um, queen c1, he wants bishop h6. I think I'll play a5 here. Don't know if it makes a difference. Thank you, Ataxiated, for the two-month resub. a4, okay, I'll play b4, obviously. 
Now knight d5. I mean, this position's getting progressively worse for white with seemingly every every passing move. Um, Richard doesn't seem to understand the threat. Okay, so he wants I ah, wants knight d2. Okay, that at least makes a lot of sense. Um, but now knight d2 hangs upon. I can play e5, takes knight e5, bishop e5, c d5. Yeah, let's go for it. What? That's just a free. Oh, he's got 94. This can't be right. I'm sure he blundered this, but whether I can actually do anything. Um, 95, 94, bishop a6, 96. No, that does not. Bishop f8, 94. f5, 96. I've got nothing. Um, oh, it feels 90. No, 93 can't be good. 96 is a huge threat here. Um, maybe I'll just play knight f8. Like, this makes some sense. Now I can always play 96 takes oh he's got this oh dear oh yeah then i just lose i think well whatever let's 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 try to fight on oh he's just got what am i doing he's just got queen h6 that was unfortunate he blundered knight, knight he blundered but unfortunately the position was so bad that i couldn't do anything about it play bishop d3 and takes um, what is okay? I'm not gonna take. I'll wait till he decides to castle. Thank you, Doctor Dragonitsky, for rating with 150. Although, actually, now I will take. So this is not correct. This structure should just be slightly better for White. So I'll play Queen C2 and Bishop D2. This is actually um, something Magnus has played a lot. Um, Rook C8. Okay, I'll just castle. He'll probably take. This is a very Magnus. Magnus has played this line a lot. Usually black has uh, normal pawns, but Magnus has played this line many times. Um, what is... Okay, he wants to go g4 again. He's trying to get trying to get chippy with this uh, weird sack. Now, I could play knight d5 to really just flatten it. Knight d5, knight d5, take six. Um, I don't like it, but I'm just going to play it. I don't like it. It's going to get flat, but whatever. He's gonna take he's gonna play knight d5. I'm gonna take, take, and play queen d3. Um, I could also sack a queen here. Do I wanna be creative here and sack a queen? Do I wanna be a do I wanna be a um do I wanna be a Levon Aronian here is the question. Yeah, let's have some fun. Let's be a Levon Aronian. Let's be a Levon Aronian here. This is what Levon would play, so I, I might as well let, let's try it. Um play bishop d6, idea to play rook c1, rook c7. Queen c6, I have rook c1, rook c8 to collect the uh, rook. Okay. I can play rook c1 anyway. Well, let's just keep going. All in. Bishop g3, b5 is coming. a6, a4, not concerned. Let's just keep keep the train Let's keep the dream alive. Uh, thank you, play the Grob, for resubbing four months in a row. You, I, I had no choice after asking that question. Yeah, I guess that's true, too. But, you know, I mean, I, I don't like sacking my queen as much as Levon does, but... um. But, okay, b5, obviously. I can play b6. Le Levon would sack, for sure. That's not even a question. So, okay. Ah, knight a5 is a very nice... Oh, shoot. I just... Yeah, knight a5 just... Ah. And this is why you don't sack your queen, boys and girls. Because it sometimes leads to just a lost position. Okay, I'll take the knight, I guess. Still, maybe some tricks here, maybe. I should probably play, like... Um, how do I do this? I guess I'll just play b6. And bishop c7, maybe. I mean, he's trying to he's trying to get fancy with rook h8 and meet me on the h file, but I don't think he actually is in time. Let's just go back. Um, rook c8, bishop c7 or something? I don't know. Okay, bishop c7, maybe. I, I mean, he's always got ideas to meet me on the h file, but whatever. Nothing I can really do about that at this point. Um, how do I play this? I've got to, let's just try to go rook a7, create the counterplay here. I'm going to try to create the counterplay and win the pawn here on b7. What do I think about Vasily Ivanchuk? Chuki is uh, an amazing player. Big fan of Chuki. If I play rook b7, what's he have? Rook h8, knight h. Oh, he's just got e5. Oh, I'm just losing my mind now. 
Yeah, yeah, I'm just losing my mind. Okay, let's uh, let's slow it down. Let's start playing just good chess. I never should have sacked my queen. That was just absurd. Um, okay, let's slow it down and just play good chess now. Let's take. We've got to move fast too. Let's just move fast. Okay, I can play. Okay, a four. I'll just castle. If I get up on the clock, I'm gonna always beat him. But I've had problems getting up on the clock against him for some reason. Wish by fate. Let's take. Um, slow it down and move fast. Slow it, by slow it down, I don't mean actually move fast. By slow it down, I mean um, I mean slow down the opening, play something a little bit more solid. Um. Never sack. Never sack a queen. Yeah, I mean, I it's, uh, I sacked the queen because it looked kind of cool, but it was obviously a very stupid decision. Let's play ninety eight. Um, okay, what does this do? I can play knight b six, I guess. No, let's just play knight b six and trade. Knight e three. What does knight e three do exactly? Just knight f six. And just rook d8, I guess. Looks okay. Okay, knight d7. Not to, uh, not to allow some weird knight d5 tricks in knight d7. Now he's going to lose the pawn. Um, queen a5, knight c4, queen c7. And... Oh, no, he can just take. Okay, so I should play rook d8. Maybe f d8 was better for knight f8. Thank you, uh, Bonin Macontro, for uh, continuing the gift sub you received from GM John Davis. Now B5, obviously. Okay, so he's, he wants to take maybe, but I've got B5, B4. What does he want? B5, 95, 95, trade, trade, B4. I don't, I mean, 96? Okay, who cares? If I'm not missing something obvious, which I trust I'm not. Okay, knight d6 is fine. I always have knight h5. I also have b4. I've also got knight c5 maybe, but knight h5 looks... Okay, just slow down. Take a deep breath and slow down. Knight h5. Um, I've got one problem. B... Okay. I'll play knight h5. Queen g5, I can play not h6. Obviously, f6 looks fine. I think knight c5. Rook d8, takes, takes. If g4, just knight f4. Try to move rook d8 in case he takes. I'm not sure if he will take. Um, knight h4. I think I can still play king g8 on takes. I have hg. Rook d8, rook d8. Yeah, I still have knight g7, so I'm fine. I'll pre move rook d8 again. I don't think he'll take, but we'll see. Queen e3. Okay, so he admits that he has nothing on the king side. So now, now it's time to start really turning up the turning up the heat on him. Um, I'm way up on, or I'm not way up on the clock actually. Play b4, kick the knight. Goes to e2 as expected. Let's just play c5. Let's let's try to move quick and turn up the heat. Knight d4. He takes. Okay, I take this way. Now I've got a great pawn chain. Um, how do I do this? Maybe just rook c8. Queen b7. I've got rook c3 now. This looks pretty good. Rook f3. Game over. Queen e2. Rook f3, and the queen can't support the rook on a6. Okay, let's get back. Let's change it up. You somebody wanted G three, so I'm gonna play. I'm gonna play G three this game. Girl, such a hallelujah. Play B three, Bishop B two. Okay, I'll just play E three. No worries, A three, I guess. Just one. 
Okay, I'm not worried. H4, just G4. If takes, I have King F1. Um, still wait for the awesome Dutch. The Dutch, the Dutch, the Dutch. I don't know what he's doing. I mean, is he castling queenside or kingside? Because H5 is basically saying I'm not castling kingside. So I probably will go long in a second. Knight E5 is interesting. Um, I'm just going to castle. I'm basically going to say you're not going this way. You're going this way. So I'm going to go this way. Um, okay, so now I've got F4. I'm, I can't resist F4. It's too, too logical of a move. Okay, I can play b4. I can also play g4. No, but let's just play b4. Oh my gosh, I just blunder h4. No, okay, he didn't see it. So I'll play knight f3. Try to plop the knight on either of his squares. g5 looks very juicy. Try to put pressure on f7 here. Oh, but now I blundered h4 anyway. <sighs> Maybe... c5 i'm gonna try something a little bit weird here so he's gonna take i'm gonna go c5 he's gonna get he plays d4 so i play c5 okay now i can take and play rook f1 maybe or queen g3 i think i'll just play rook f1 um he's still got this issue deal with this annoying pawn on f7 his bishop is kind of tr out of play temporarily um but I don't like my position. That much I will say. So I'll take, I'll take. Um, maybe it's not so bad. His bishop is not great here. Um, play knight e4. Yeah, let's play knight e4, try to exchange. I'll give him the two rooks with the bad bishop. Um, I have no problem giving him the... Uh, Nick Tom says, man, your schedule is killing me. It's 4 a.m. here, but I gotta stay late for the stream. Sorry, Nick Tom. Um, I guess that means you are in russia or you're in europe you're somewhere in europe i guess um okay knight d5 that's a very logical move queen g7 he's got 93 i guess do i care maybe maybe not um i can also just move my queen or no i can't um uh, i think i'll just play queen g3 support the pawn bishop b8 uh oh this is a problem um Okay, let's just play h4. I feel like I'm about to blunder something. But maybe I can take and play knight f6 or knight g5. Oh, but he's just got the... Uh, ah. Okay, if I play h5, rook g2. Okay, maybe knight f6 first. Or... What am I doing? I'm just playing bad chess. Oh, he's got rook b2 again. Oh my gosh. Play the other order. <sighs> playing bad chess. Mm, playing bad chess right now. I mean, rook d4, I take and go king b3, I think. I mean, oh, bishop f4, wow, okay. Um, Wow, that's an amazing move. Uh, let's see. Okay, now the problem here is I'm down on time. If I take... Can't take. Um, knight f7... Okay, but... Oh, but he's got rook b2. Oh, shoot. What am I doing? <sighs> he's playing terrible chess right now. Let's go to a4. Let's have some fun. Be cheeky, at least. Um, rook e1. Rook e4. Maybe I'll... Don't even know what I'm doing now. I just lost, but. Although. What is E? Maybe. King A5 and. Okay.
No, but I mean, this doesn't work either, but okay, whatever, let's see. Oh, but, okay, what? What is that? Oh my gosh. What is that? I mean... What was that? Okay. Let's turn, turn it around. Let's turn it around. Let's turn it around. <sighs> Let's turn it around. That wasn't Lucky Car made it close, apparently. I mean, that was not. Let's not pretend that was some great game, though. I can tell you this is not the Dutch. I keep forgetting you guys want the Dutch. Okay, I'll give you a Dutch. I'll give you a Dutch. Chill out. I'll give you a Dutch. <laughs> uh, E5 or C5? E5 is flat. E5 is objectively better, I think. So I'll play E5. Takes knight of... Okay, whatever. Oh, bishop G5. Um, F6, knight F6, bishop F6, bishop F6, queen F6, bishop B7, queen F2, king H1. Um, takes... Rook D8. Whatever, let's just play it safe. Okay. Oh, but now he's got rook c1. Oh, jeez. Yeah, now I'm just busted again. <sighs> Bishop c6 takes knight f8, I guess. But it's just gross. Uh, Bishop f4 is a terrible move. I mean, I'm so much worse, but why? Bishop c6 just trapped my rook for the rest of the game. I mean, Bishop Bishop f4 is just like... Daniel would have played Bishop c6 in like all of two seconds. Um, I don't know why he played Bishop f4. Like, it's still... Wait, wait a second. Can I take? What am I missing? Rook e8, queen... Okay, but now I have knight f6, and my rook supports... Okay. Knight d5, knight f4. If I trade. Queen f3 at the end? Oh, is this Daniel style? Am I going to beat him Daniel style here? Knight f4, g4, check. King f1, queen f3. Rook e8, king g7. Whatever, I can't resist it. I've got to go for it. I can't resist. Let's, let's go Daniel style. I don't know. Oh! Oh, come on! Oh, come on. Queen g4. King f1, queen f... Oh. Oh. <sighs> I think that was puzzle rush. I think that was just checkmate. Queen, f queen g4, queen f3 is puzzle rush. Danny can tell me if I'm wrong, but I think that was just Puzzle Rush. Um, Oh, but now I give me a five. I, I should have played C3 first. Mm. 
Uh, maybe I had bishop g5 also. But I think queen g4, queen f3 was mate. I think it was just a forced mate if I'm not losing my mind, which I could be. Play bishop g5. Oh, let's get back to the playlist. Um, play a5. I also... What about d4? I think I'll play d4 here. Okay, h6. I have bishop e3. I can take and play c3, b4. Um, I can take and play a5. Nah, that looks stupid. Let's just go back to e3. Okay, knight g4, so he wants to take. So now I thought I could play a5, maybe. And maybe try to trap the bishop with c3 or something. I don't know if it works. Yes, these are uh, chess-based playlists. Have a great evening, Mr. Dr. Dragoninsky, also known as Daniel Naroditsky. Um, uh, good games, as usual. Um, hope you have a good evening, and good luck with writing all those papers. I do not envy you in... I do not envy you at all for that. That's, uh, I'm glad that I don't have to write any papers anymore. Okay, queen h4 threatening. Okay, h3. Knight e5. I do have some rook a4. Let's try it. Knight c4, rook b4. Bishop c5 takes and bishop b5 or something. I'm a little bit confused, but yeah. Okay, so knight a5, so he's trying to say his, his knight is okay on the rim here, which is hard to believe. I have bishop c3. Um, queen, yeah, actually, what about just bishop c3? Idea to play rook e4 check and win the knight. And now knight g3, rook e4, win the knight, win the queen, and the, this is just game over. I also have rook e1. Also, I have knight, knight f5. Um, this should just be game over, I think. Okay, knight e5. There's rook e4, f4. I mean, f4 right away was also winning, but this should be good enough. This takes. Uh, thank you, Feather Sloop, for the three-month resub. This is obviously just winning. Um, also, knight g3 and f4. He still can't do anything. Um, play g6, bishop g7. Keep it, keep it real. Oh, you guys wanted a Dutch! Oh, no! Oh, no. Um. Oh, shoot. I'm such an idiot. Sorry, you guys. Sorry about that. I'm such an idiot. Okay, next game. Somebody remind me next game, okay? Somebody remind me next game to freaking play a Dutch. Let's have some fun. Let's play bishop h6 and trade. Oh, sorry. He played e4, not d4 on move one. I'm okay. I'm just losing. I'm losing my mind. What is wrong with me? If f okay, I guess I'll just play queen e7. If f4, I'm gonna take and go like knight g4, or knight d7. Um, do I want h5? Guess I'll play h5 because I think I'm probably going to castle long or go king g7. So I think I want to play this structure since now he's not playing f4 anymore. Knight a4, okay, that's um pretty reasonable move. Do I? I can get creative like Richard and play knight a6. Or I can just play knight d7, which also makes a lot of sense here. But uh, he's just going to try to trade everything on a4. Um, let's just go king f8. Rook f1. Okay, now I will take. Okay, knight c5. Hit the bishop and king g7 next move. Should be okay here. Plays f4, very interesting. I was not actually expecting that. I thought I could just take and play like king g7 and rook f8. I also have bishop g4, doesn't do anything, so I'll just take king g7, looks fine. Uh, thank you, face chess, for gifting a sub to Light Rider. Thank you for gifting a sub, face chess. 
Um, e5, I just take. I've also bishop f5. Messy position. Very, very messy. Um, can play 97, 95, maybe. Yeah, let's go 97, 95. Thank you, BD1491.59 for the two month resub. Um, not completely okay, but it's getting better. Okay, just plays e5. I guess I'll take with the knight. I need the knight on e5, obviously. Um, I think bishop d7 looks okay. Takes, I take with a pawn. Everything's still stable. If I can get the rook d8, f8, and f6. Knight e4, I think just f5. Yeah, f takes, I just take. If knight c5... Uh-oh. Okay, it doesn't do it. I can play b6, maybe. I can also play... I think I should just play rook e8. Consolidate if I can. H4, logical. Um, I have b6. I don't know if c5 is a threat. I assume it's not. Well, okay, let's play rook f8. I want to go queen f6, but he had knight e4 because of the uh, pin there. So I'm going to play rook f8 first. Okay, now I think I'll just go queen f6. He's going to take. I'll take with the pawn. Queen d4. Okay, I can take and play queen d6. I can also move my knight to like... Or bishop b5, maybe. Bishop b5, rook f2, knight d3. Bishop b5, rook g1, knight d3. Knight e6 takes. Rook e8 takes. Um. Um. Let's just go for it. I don't know if it works. Thank you, Padala22, for subscribing to Twitch Prime. I don't know if it works, but I'm going to try. He's going to go like Rook G1. I'm going to go Knight D3. If Knight D6, I take. If Queen F6, I go King G7. Knight H7, King G7, because the Rook is hanging. So Knight D3. He can also take on E8, but then I just take on E8. I can't take on D4 because then he has Knight E6 check and Knight D4. So I'll pre move Rook E8 in case he takes. I don't know if he will. Um, but. I've got to go for it. I'm down on the clock. I'm in trouble time-wise, so let's go for it. It takes. Okay. I can play rookie one. Okay. Takes, takes. He's got 96 king. Whoops. Takes. Um, just bishop d7. Takes knight g2. I think I'm just winning. These I'm going to have three connected roaming all the way up the board here. So it should just be winning. Okay, takes. Ah, he's got bishop a4. Tricky, tricky. Oh, shoot. Um, Whatever. I've still got to go for it. Um, this is dangerous. I don't know if I can survive this. Okay, bishop b7. Okay, f4. b5, f2. Oh, what am I doing? I mean, I just take on b4. What am I doing? <sighs> Playing such bad chess right now. I mean, yeah. I mean, I'm down. I'm down on the clock too. So careless. Terrible. Absolutely terrible. If I don't waste those five seconds at the start, I probably have a chance to. Oh, okay, let's put together a streak here. Time to put a streak on. Okay, time to time to run it up against him. Let's 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 get a little bit more serious. He's also very slow on the clock, so I just need to move quicker. I'm just moving way too slowly. What's this? It's a free pawn. Push B three, Rook D one. Okay, Queen F two. Now I'm just winning the pawn. This is terrible for uh, this is terrible for uh, for Black here. 
No, I am playing bad chess. I because I also on B4 I could have traded on B4 too, and I would have avoided the whole thing completely if I traded on B4. But I mean, whatever. What is this? If I take and play like bishop. What is this? Takes? No, I mean I am playing bad chess though. I'm playing bad chess. I'm not playing good chess tonight. That that is very very clear. Um, queen g5. That does absolutely nothing. I have bishop c5. Um, let's not be stupid here. Why is this? Oh, now I blundered this because he's got bishop d4. Okay, rook d1. He can't can't move the rook, so this should be winning. But yeah, I, I don't always play good chess. I do play bad chess. Uh, I would say on average, like one out of every seven days or so, I play bad chess. I don't play play great. Uh, I would say it's one out of every seven days, roughly, that I throw in a complete lemon. What? What? Wait a second. This can't... Um, what? What am I? Am I missing something? Oh my, oh my gosh. Did I really just blunder this? Okay, whatever, I can still try. Rook f2. If takes, I just take rook f8. Rook d2 or rook f1. I'm guessing... Um, guessing rook f1. So if knight e5, I can then go king h1, or I'm hitting the rook. I miss playing everything. I had to do that because otherwise rook b8 traps my queen. Um, the knights cover everything. The queen covers all the squares and the king covers this square as well. So that's why I'm chucking the piece right back. I'll pre queen d5. Now there are no ways to trap the queen because I also have extra squares due to the knight. Um, he also has to be careful because the rook on f8. I mean there is a pin but the rook on f8 is hanging so... Um, so let's let's see what he's gonna do here. But he's also way down on the clock here, so I should just win this. Okay, there we go. Uno, uno. Let's keep it rolling. Yes, you guys get it. There's your Dutch. Everybody, you've been begging for it. There's your Dutch. There's your Dutch. Uh, let's just play d5. There's Bishop d6, I guess. a6 maybe c5 maybe just castles okay he's playing this line um this is not really fantastic i'll just play c5 and takes knight c6 i guess c4 just castles cd5 knight d5 should be fine um let's see so takes and b5 is a bit blah um don't like a5. I think I'm just going to play bishop a7 here. Probably just knight d5. Bishop c4. Okay, logical. I can take and play like queen f6. Let's just take. And queen f6. Support the pawn. Rook e8. I have b5. Pawn is hanging on b2. I can also play bishop b8 to remove the knight from f4. Play rook e8. Knight a5 and b5 maybe. Very, very sharp. G5 is also playable maybe. What about... Um, yeah, let's just... I don't know if this works, but I'm going to go for it. It's very, very risky. But I feel like it's... Oh, I could have played b5 too. Whatever, okay. Maybe b5 or knight a5 because now the queen protects e8. Okay, do I want to play b5 or do I want to play... Tough to decide. Knight a5. 
But also, no, G4 is no good. Um, no, I played this terribly. I'll just play B5. I should have done this without G5. I could have just played B5 right away. What? Wait. I've got E5? Wow. Um. Wait. E this can't possibly work. Wait, F4? Or G4, one second. Knight D8 makes no sense. Um. 5, Rook C1, Rook C2. E5, rook e6, big six, knight e5, rook d6, e5, rook c5, rook d8. Well, let's try it. I don't know if it works, but I've got no time, so let's just go for it. Plays h4. Okay, that doesn't. Okay, now I'll just play rook b8 and hit the queen. Whoops. Oh, don't, don't blunder, please. Maybe just um, G4, Rook C6 takes 95 is a big problem. Um, F4 doesn't work. Can I move my knight? Not really. Um, oh, let's just go for it. Well, but now I just. I replace H5, which I think is wrong. Queen E8. No, H5 was stupid. Rook C6 was winning, I think. What was H5? Although I've got no time here, so I do have this that slight issue. If he takes, I'll take the knight. Um, so I do need to focus. Knight E4, I take. Um, I mean, FE3 seems like the only try, so I've got to go for it. Maybe I'm getting mated here. That wouldn't be shocking either, but I've got to go for this. Maybe bishop d7. Takes. Queen h5. What's going on here? This is getting very, very sharp suddenly. So I've got queen h1, rook b2. He resigns? Oh, why did he resign? Why did he resign? Why did he resign? Why did he resign? I, the game is, I, okay, I'm confused. I mean, I just, why did he resign? I don't even, um, whatever. Okay, let's just play A3. I'm just, I don't know why he resigned. It was, the game was very much alive. Um, whatever. Okay, I'll just play. Well, I'm also just worse here, I think. Um, uh, okay, let's play B4, kick the bishop and play knight A4. Knight of three, which should be two. I'm definitely worse here whether I'm losing or not. I don't know. Maybe C4. That's so ugly, but whatever. I'll do it anyway. <sighs> rook C8, Rook C1 should be okay. Maybe, maybe not. Stockfish absolutely hated that position for Richard. Okay, I mean, it just didn't seem clear to me that it was losing on the spot for black for or for white. So, um, anyway, I do need to focus again because I'm in some deep hot water. Um, 
queen e1 or queen b3? Queen e2, bishop g4 could be an issue. h3, bishop f3. What am I doing? I'm also moving way too slowly again. Oh, pre-move GF. Oh, jeez, I'm in. Yeah, I was playing bad chess. Whatever, I'm going to try to keep the game. I mean, I should probably resign him down 30 seconds, but I'll play on. Let's see if I can somehow swindle him. Almost certainly I can't, but it's worth a shot. I'll pre-move rook c1. Try to start to press him on the clock. Maybe queen c7. I'm just going to try to press him on the clock a little bit if I can. Okay, who cares? Just a4. Oh, he's just, I'm his back ranker, of course. What am I doing? Ah, uh, playing such bad chess tonight. Let's go, wake up. Playing such garbage tonight. Play e6, maybe c5, um, or bishop g6, let's take. Um, or c5 takes. Knight a4, play c4, and also take, um, I'm just moving way too slowly tonight, um, let's just take, uh, knight e7, I'll take, I'll take, bishop g3, um, why not, just b5, um, Let's try to keep it more complicated with the knight against bishop. Normally, I would take the other way. Oh, and I just blunder queen d4, of course, because I'm on such fine form tonight. Um, there's just queen e7, king d7. Yeah, just playing bad chess. Now, I'm not going to be playing much longer because I'm just playing badly. Um... Rook a c8. It takes. Yeah, okay. That's. I'm going to have to stop in a second, I think, because I'm just really playing badly. If I can't win like three or four in a row, let's say three. I'm going to say four more. I'll just win like four in a row and then stop because I'm really playing bad chess right now. Really, really bad chess at the moment. Just a free pawn if I want it. I don't even. I'm gonna play b3, maybe d3 in castles. Just castle here. And queen f2. C4, I can take and play rook d1. Um, Plays d4, wow. Maybe just rookie one. Um, put queen e one. Queen c seven. So I'm trying to take the pawn, I guess. I, was, I don't like g three, but I'll play it. Knight d two, knight e four. I think is playable. Of course, I can also just blunder knight e three because I'm not paying any attention right now. So bad. Ah. Uh.
Okay. Okay, let's play rookie one. I have queen h5 and knight c5 maybe. Takes, takes, I mean, at least I got my pawn back, but still not really very spectacular. I shouldn't lose at least now, unlike before. Okay, I can play knight d7. I can also play... I don't really want to trade. I mean, I want to try and win this, but laugh. It's impossible to win this. Um, knight e4, queen... Uh, let's play knight e4 and queen e2, I guess. Knight e3. No, I don't even... Have... No, I do have Bishop too because I have Queen E1. Wake up. Get Knight C5, I guess. I might be able to win this. Um, definitely going to try. Let's try Knight C5 and Bishop B8. Oh, but I hang a two. <sighs> but now I win the pawn. Okay, he's misplayed this. This is still probably a draw, but Let's um, keep trying to push. I'm way up on the clock, so I've got to try to win this one. Like, got to keep the pressure alive. Oh, I blundered d3. What am I doing? Yeah, it's just not going to be my knight. <sighs> Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. I mean, I don't even know if... I, how do I even try to win this? Um, never I'll try, because, like, why not? I, the other one was, of course, much better than this. Okay, let's just make the draw. Uh, Terrible, terrible, terrible. Knight c5, king c2, because I put the bishop on the wrong square, but that was just garbage. Again, playing terrible chess. I'm going to try to win, like, two more and stop, because I'm really playing bad chess right now. Um, I mean, the only bright side is that I'm still going to win the match, but really, really bad chess tonight. Oh, uh, I think GF is fine. I did not miss a knight fork. Knight c5, king c2 wins the bishop on c1. 
Um, no, I didn't miss a knight fork, you guys. Just queen c7 and castles. Knight h4, bishop g6. No, knight c5, king c2, knight takes d7, king takes c1. It doesn't work, you guys. Oh, it's just castle. I'm just bishop d6, a6, maybe b6 and c5. Okay, now I'll play c5. D5 I can take, so I have rook e8. I connected my rooks. Um, oh, shoot, but now I gave him... Queen b3, king b8. Okay, he's giving me a pawn. I mean, I have to grab it. If I don't grab it, then what's the point? Queen f3. Wait, I've got knight c5, I've got knight e5 also, or I'm gonna go king b8. I don't see a mate. I don't see a mate for white here, so I've gotta play it. Okay, so he takes, I take, I'm up a clean pawn here, but white does have a lot of compensation in this position. Um, I can play knight c5 and bishop e5 maybe. I can also play like knight e5, actually, yeah, 95's got to be right. I'm going to play g5, g4, and just lock him up. Um, if I can, just g4. Knight f3 should be winning. So, okay, this is good. This is good. I'm going to win this one. Um, or I should win this one. Maybe it's not. Knight f3 takes. Still not so easy. I thought it was just winning. Takes, takes, queen f3. Bishop g3 takes. Should be winning. Yeah, it's messy though. Okay. Um, let's just go knight f3 takes. And maybe. Um, how about bishop e5? Bishop g3 was playable too, but I, I figure this has to be winning. I can just take. Is, yeah, bishop f4, bishop d4, rook b1, bishop d4. This is just winning. If takes, then I take and go like rook d8, and I mean, if I can't win that, then, you know, I don't, I shouldn't be playing. Although, he's going to get h4. Okay, play c4, which I think is a bad move, but I have to prove it. Um, not rook d3, maybe rook um how do i prove this okay my rook is under attack okay he wants to go c5 so i'm gonna play rook d2 for starters i'm also again moving way too slowly maybe queen d7 idea queen d4 oh i've also got queen d3 as a threat um Queen d6. Oh, I just blundered. Why? Why did I do that? Oh my gosh. What am I doing? What am I doing tonight? It's really ridiculous. Oh, like I look at king c8 and then I play queen d6. I think about king c8 and then I play queen d6 like a complete bozo. Um, How do I do this? Rook f8. King d6. Maybe just rook c8, hit the bishop. Okay, eight. I've got king c5 though. Rook a6. Okay, but I mean I can't lose and I'm up I'm up on the clock. So okay, so he plays h5, which is obviously wrong. Let's play rook h7. Be careful, don't do anything stupid. Of course, immediately I start to do stupid things again. Um, what am I doing? Jeez. Rook d6. 
I'm gonna win the game, but I'm not happy. I'm not happy at all with my play. I mean, I'm gonna flag him, but I'm not happy. Okay, so what? Whoops. Oh, that would have been very poor. Uh... Terrible chess. Not good. <sighs> now you're four. Um, cheer up, Ikaro. You're doing good. You're plus three in the match. You're doing good. Uh, I mean, good is a relative term. I'm not I'm not playing good chess. I'm just playing terrible chess. The only upside is that yes, I'm playing terrible chess and I'm still gonna win the match, but um but that's not really much of a consolation. Okay, wait, what? Um I guess hmm. How do I want yeah, I should probably play H3. G4. I think I'm gonna go long here. Ninety-two. Maybe A4. Okay, I'm gonna have to castle Kingside. I don't want to, but I have to. Um, I can play C3. I can also play D4. I'm gonna play d4 here. Play rookie one, knight f1. c5. Okay, let's play c3. If you're feeling down, just remember that Ivanchik is a real person and then everything will be all right. Hmm. That's, um. That's, um, interesting. That's an interesting statement. That's a, um. That's, uh. A very interesting statement. Not even sure what to make <laughs> of that statement. Um, <laughs> yeah, I'm really not sure what to make of that statement. I don't know whether... Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I don't even know. Do I have knight d4 and f4? I can also play knight e6. Yeah, I'm going to go for it. So on knight e5, I'm going to play f4. If queen h4, I just take... If he goes back, then I go knight c6 and I win um material. Okay, he goes for it. Um h4 takes. Queen h3. Okay, I mean uh, it's too too impossible not. Wait, what? Oh, he's got queen b6 check. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Unbelievable. All right, so knight c5, I guess bishop takes a5 is okay. Um, let's take. Um, I have bishop b4, I think. Knight e4, just queen e2, trade. And... Okay, I can't take. Queen e2, and take six. Rook b8. Rook b8. Maybe it's queen a2. Oh, but now he can take d3 and he gets like queen d3 and it's all bad news. Although he misses it. So now I get knight b5 to cut the queen at least. So maybe it's, eh, it's, it's bad, but maybe it's not the end of the world. Um, somehow I need to exchange material. Maybe knight g5, ah, then fg4. I don't want to go g5, but I'll do it. Um, how do I, maybe bishop, um, no, maybe just... I'm going to go bishop a3, bishop b2, try to exchange like this. That was take. Okay, I guess it will take. Bishop e7 looks good. Hit the rook, hit the knight. Still got knight e6. It's still very, very messy. Let's 
so I take. I play queen c2, queen c6 is coming here. Take the c file, maybe knight c7 is an idea as well. Okay, queen c6 obviously. Hit the queen, hit the knight. Knight f4, just king f3 should be good. I can take knight d... Or... I mean, again, somehow there always are tricks for this guy. Or I can just, um, where do I want to go? F1? I guess I'll go to F1. Takes. But this is not correct, my friend. Just E6, Rook D1, and okay. Oh, he can take. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What am I doing? Oh my gosh. Luckily, it doesn't matter. It's just completely winning. Check takes. GG. Okay, let's play solid. Let's just play solid chess. Um... Uh, several moves here. I think I'll play queen e7 this time. Play knight d7. Okay, so he wants to play this Fabiano b4, like a5, knight c4, and b4. I'll play a5. Because on knight c4, I can still play f6, and he's not in time with b4 here. Plays knight f1. Interesting. Okay. So let's play f6, knight f8, knight e6. Play knight f8. I can also play... I think I'll just play g6, knight f8 like this. Not really worried about h4, h5, so I'm going to play knight f8, knight e6 now. Okay, so he wants to play for d4. I'm going to castle and play rook d8 here. You can also play a4, maybe fix the pawns. Rook d8. If I get b5, bishop b6, I should be fine. Oh, shoot. Bishop d4. Bishop b4. Bishop c5, 94, 94. Queen c4. 96. Wait, 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 wait. Whatever. If this loses, it loses. So be it. But. If bishop b4, c5, 95. Oh, but. Eh. Oh, this is just terrible, probably. Okay. Yeah, it's just terrible. I missed knight d5. I can try queen d6, I guess. Okay. I guess I have to play b5. I'm gonna go like queen a2. King g7 or something. Hmm, this is not good. Um, this is not good at all. What's queen d3? Interesting. So I have knight d4 here, maybe. Wait. Wait, I do have knight d4 takes. I just take queen d4 c6. No, queen d3 is a terrible move. Queen b5, I had bishop a6, but this... Wait, what? He's got... Wait, what? Oh, he's got queen b4? But I can trade. Okay. This is still bad for me, but... Oh, bishop b7 was better, of course. Maybe c5 and bishop e6. Let's think for a second. Um... I think I'm just going to take, play rook d8. He'll play knight d3, I assume, and... King f7, king e7. Rook d6. It's marginally worse. Let's just play g5, takes, takes. D8. King V6 maybe. 
play rook e8. A4 takes, maybe bishop f5. Let's check. Okay, he goes for f4. Interesting. Okay, so I will take. Um, I'll play bishop h3, maybe. Maybe bishop g2 ideas. His knight is good, but it can also become a liability. I'm just going to play h5, h4. I mean, okay, whatever. Let's go for it. Let's let's try to go for it with h4 here. Okay, e5. So now I throw in bishop f5. If, uh, he can't take right. No, he moves the rook. I check and I take and I play like rook d5. I think he misplayed um, misplayed this. Oh, although he still has e f6 at the end. Wait, what? Oh, he's got king f4. Whatever, I've just got to go for it. Check. Now rook d2. Hit the knight. Now, okay, whatever. Just takes. I'm going to take b2. h2, e7. Um... Oh shoot. Um I can take. Before these pawns must be too fast, surely. These, these pawns have to be too fast. A3, yeah, this is just game over. <sighs> Alright, let's go again. Let's get back to basics here. Thank you, BJH, for the 19-month resub. Wow, 19 months is a long time. Hikaru, cheer up. Just a game. Choo-choo. It's just a game. Chaz is just a game. That's all it is. Just a game. Uh, thank you, Ozel73, for the three-month resub. Thank you. John Davis says, I love these kind of end games. Yeah, with three pawns against a rook. I mean, he misplayed it really badly. Okay, C4. Um, I think d4 is okay here. I just take. Okay, so he plays d6. Um, play like knight c3. I think I'm just gonna go queen d2 here. So knight c3 and queen c2. Mrs. Robinson, this loves you more than you will know. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, takes? Oh, wait, no, just, okay, whatever. I'll just play bishop h3, hit the rook, and then I move the knight, play f3, e4. Pretty standard boilerplate maneuvers. Um, I have b4 as well. Is he going rook h5? Maybe. But I think knight e1 makes the most sense, because now knight d3 will hit the rook on uh, c5 as well. Wait, he's singing. That means he'll win this. Maybe. Chess is more than a game. It's turn-based strategy, according to the stream. <laughs> indeed, indeed. Okay, the rook on h5 looks a little bit weird. I'm going to play f3, cut the diags, uh, restrict the knight. I also have g4 lurking here with g5 ideas because of the pin. Knight d3, maybe. No threats anymore here on h2 or f2. Um, so position looks pretty good. Now, I could play g4 here. Rook e5, knight d3, rook g5. Um, yeah, let's go for it. I don't see a reason why this doesn't work. If rook g5, I have h4. If rook a5, I have b4. If rook e5, I have knight d3. So I don't see it. I don't see it here. I don't see it here for Mr. Uh, Lilliputian. I have b4 here or knight d3. I think knight d3 is... Oh, wait, on no, 83, then he gets e5. Oh, wait, but then. Oh, but then everything I did is just insane. Maybe, maybe not. Okay, so obviously queen b2 or queen c3. I'm gonna go queen b2. Keep keep the diag open. Rook a5. Okay, so his rook is getting completely boxed. I'm gonna play b4. Try to play against this rook. This rook is insane here. Um, um, maybe just. 
Wait, a4, queen, c4, e4, maybe? Yeah, I'm going to play a4. I'm going to give him the pawn and play e4 with the idea of playing knight f2. And then, barring some crazy thing, like knight e4, I've got knight e5, or knight f2 as well. Wait, knight c5? I don't see it. Rook covers, knight covers, queen is trapped. Game over. Nose. Let's go again. Body knows. Everybody. The bishop c5. The streak is back. I mean, I'm trying. I mean, I'm trying. Doesn't mean I'm playing great. I still don't feel like I'm playing great chess, but I'm not playing badly. At least I'm playing decently now. How many more till adoption? Like six more. Not even close. Let's not even talk about adoption because that's not realistic yet. Okay. Um, you can play g4, but now I think d5 is strong. Okay, I'll play d5. You can play d4. I think rook e8 makes sense. Just rook e8, queen d7, rook d8. Just play logical moves. Um... Okay, now I'll play d4. Try to play against this bad bishop behind this pawn chain. Knight b3. Um, I can take. I can also just play... I think bishop b6 is correct. Takes, I take, and then I like have knight d5, knight b4 ideas. Let's go um, queen d7. Maybe ideas to hit the pawn on h3. Maybe rook d8 and just takes ideas with taking and winning the pawn. Play rook h d8. Maybe I should have taken on c3. I guess we'll see what he wants to do here. Plays c4. So is he's going all in here with g4. Oh, I can take and play d3. Yeah, so let's go for it. Takes and d3. I'll pre-move it. Luckily, g4, g5 is not really a threat because the h3 is hanging at the end. Um, so it's starting to turn around. Bishop h3, g h3, and knight h2. Okay, let's let's go for, let's let's go for the kill with knight before. Thank you, Keith Patrick Five, for the six month resub. Are we not able to renew our subscription with Bitcoin anymore? I honestly don't have any idea. If g5, I just take, and then d3, c2, b3, everything's collapsing. Okay, um, so he's trying to play for, but g5 is not a threat, so he's playing for knight f5. I've also got knight e4, maybe. Let's go for the absolute sledgehammer. It's sledgehammer time. Um, knight e4, dc4, d3, queen. Knight e4 is what I want to play, but then dc4, d3, queen e4, knight c2, queen e4. I mean, this should just be winning somehow. Maybe just queen e6. Let's just play queen e6. No, I'm threatening to just win the knight on b3. I really wanted to play knight e4, but I thought after dc4, I, I didn't see knight c2, queen e4. I didn't see the continuation. I have to be careful with knight f5 coming. Um, I mean, he'll, I guess he'll... Well, okay, he goes knight f5. So he's just saying all in. Here he's just playing for g5. Okay, now though, I think I have some knight e4 tricks lurking. Okay, so I can take... G5, bishop c2, gf6, bishop d3. It's still not obvious. I mean, I know I'm winning here. It's just a question of what the right way to win this is. Um, knight, I mean, I really want to play knight e4. G5, knight takes e4. Let's just take here. Just take here. If queen e4, I have bishop d5. If knight g7, I just take. This is game over. This is game over. Everybody knows. Okay, this is now things are starting to turn around. Things, what does that do? I don't see it. I just gain another piece. And then King H8. Yeah, he's just, he's down one. He's already down two pieces. Yeah, okay, much better. Declined, declined, challenge declined. Okay, so I got back to 3183, so at least I got back to something 
halfway respectable at least, but um, halfway respectable. Sorry, what? Excuse me? What? What?